You're going to love this. Trust me, what you're seeing now is my normal state. This is a Super Saiyan. This is what is known as a Super Saiyan that has ascended past a Super Saiyan. Or you could just call this a Super Saiyan 2. And this is to go even further beyond. Yo, what is up guys, Matsani here, and today I'm gonna be going for my 500 pound deadlift PR. So about two weeks ago, I got 475 pounds, two or three weeks ago, I'm not sure when, but it felt pretty easy and I've been bulking and I'm about to end my bulk soon and I'm like, I've gotten pretty fat. You guys can see right here, I'm like, like 187, 188 pounds. So I'm just trying to get in one last deadlift PR before I cut down again, because obviously when you cut, you're gonna lose strength. So yeah, I just finished my warm up and now I'm hopefully gonna go and try to get that 500 pound deadlift. And yeah, if I do, you guys will see this video. If I don't, then I don't. All right guys, so I didn't record all of my warm up sets. I only started recording from 405 pounds, but usually when I warm up before a PR, I usually start with a plate on each side, then I add a plate every time. So I did 135 for about 10 to 12 reps, then I did 225 for about eight to 10, 315 for like four to six. And when I got to 405, I did about four reps and it felt pretty easy, it felt pretty light. So I went up to 455 and I was just gonna see how many reps I can, uh, I didn't wanna go to failure, so I just got about two reps. So I got two reps and it felt really easy and really light. And I thought I could get like five or six reps, but I didn't go to failure, I just did about two reps because I wanted to save my energy. So then I was like, all right, man, we're feeling good, we're feeling strong, so let's just do it. Let's go for the 500. And yeah, here it is, guys. Here's the 500 pound deadlift. <laughs> Alright guys, there you have it. That's my 500 pound deadlift. Obviously, this is a really big thing for me because this has been my goal for like the past six months. And I just want to tell you guys to obviously set big goals. No matter how big the seam, you guys will achieve them. Obviously, there's going to be failure in the way. Like, I'll show you guys a clip right here. In the start of the year in January, I tried deadlifting 500 pounds too. I was like, let's just try it. Why not? Let's see how far we can get. And when I tried it, I could barely lift the weight off the ground. You guys can see right here, I barely got it off the ground. And obviously, that was really demotivating. But I told myself not to give up. I mean, if someone else can do it, obviously you can do it. So I never gave up. I stayed consistent. I kept grinding in the gym. And I finally got it three months later. So I'm just, I just want to tell you guys the same thing. Like, just keep grinding. Whatever goal you have, whether it's benching 100 pounds, 200 pounds, whatever goal you have, just keep grinding towards it. If you guys stay consistent, be patient, you guys will achieve that goal, all right? And yeah, thank you all so much for watching the video. That's my 500 pound deadlift, and I'm looking forward to setting new goals. And now I'm just gonna cut down for the summer now. I've gotten pretty fat ever since bulking up. I'm at like 187 pounds, 188 pounds. I'm not sure exactly, but I've gotten pretty fat and I wanna get back in shape so I can get ready for the summer. And yeah, that's basically it guys. Thank you all so much for watching this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the edit. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Thank you all so much for the recent support. And yeah, that's basically it guys.